Hello tankers, and welcome to another episode of Garage Reviews with Spiral Tarantula. Today I'd like to talk about the Panzerkampfwagen 38H 735F, or as many people know it as the Micro Mouse, Tier 2 German Premium Light Tank. Now you might be wondering, this doesn't look like a German tank at all. Well, and you would be correct, it's not a German tank. It's actually a French tank that the German army captured after they conquered France in 1940. This tank is not available in either the French or the German tech trees, and it is only available for a limited time via the store. I didn't purchase it from the store. I actually completed, uh, there was an op, I think back in July, where you had to get 100,000 experience, and your reward for completing the op was this tank. At first, I thought, oh, great, a crappy tier 2 light tank, whoopee, big deal. Um, actually, this thing is a monster as you can imagine from it being the Micro Mouse. It has 40 millimeter thick armor everywhere, and by everywhere I mean absolutely everywhere. There isn't a weak spot on this tank. Well, maybe. There's a couple, actually. Okay, looking at the stats, uh, it has an absolutely pitiful engine, a tier 1 Hotchkiss engine, only 75 horsepower, so you're not getting anywhere quickly at all. Uh, it's got a really 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 high rate of fire on the gun uh, but the penetration is only 41 millimeters which is okay for a, a tier 2 tank um, and 40 average damage uh, the traverse speed on it is actually really really good for a tier 2 um, but the engine is just what is the definitely the, the weakness of this tank it is just so slow it is unbelievably slow now an interesting thing about this tank is I have a crew specifically designed for this tank um, and currently I have jack of all trades on there which I will explain why in a second um, the only other thing I can recommend is brothers in arms maybe uh, clutch braking maybe uh, track mechanic because you will get tracked a lot in this thing and that's really about it again it's a tier 2 light tank so don't be expecting to you know get a sack full of silver from playing in this thing. It's really easy to actually lose silver when you're playing in this. Um, Supply-wise, you'll notice I only have a f small first aid kit. Like I said before, um, you don't want to spend a whole lot of extra money uh, pimping this thing out because you will lose a lot of silver. And you won't get very much silver anyway because this thing only plays in Tier 2 and Tier 3 matches. The reason I only have a first aid kit is because there are only two crew members in this thing, the commander and the driver. And it and the driver gets knocked out a lot in this thing. Um, the commander not so much, but you need a first aid kit, because if you lose both of your crew members, your tank is essentially knocked out. Um, equipment wise, I only put a ventilation system on there uh, just to increase the crew uh, capabilities by a little bit. But I wouldn't recommend putting any other equipment on the thing, it's, it's ex too expensive. If you miss out on the sale, you can get the Hotchkiss H35, which is a Tier 2 French tank, um, and you'll see that it has pretty similar stats to the Micro Mouse. Um, it's not exactly the same thing, but if you miss out on getting the Micro Mouse, this is the, the next best thing you can get. Um, it's essentially the same thing, I suppose, um, but, it's not a, but it's not a premium tank. Um, and there it is in the store. It's about 5,200 gold, so it, it's a little pricey, but you get premium time with it, um, and you get a pretty good amount of silver. Uh, I didn't have to pay for my mic micro mouse because I completed the ops, um, but it's a it's a fun little tank to to play around in. Uh, as I mentioned, this tank does have one critical weakness on the front, the driver's hatch, and then the front of the turret. There's the commander's hatch or the little commander's viewpoint or viewport. Honestly, that's really the only weakness on this tank. Even the rear of it's got 40 millimeters of armor on it. Um, and if you can angle this thing, it's it's almost impenetrable. And most players in Tier 2 and Tier 3 matches just spray you with auto cannons anyway, so um, getting scores of like 7 or 8 kills is pretty commonplace in this thing. Um, unless people end up buying it, and then you'll see that it's uh, it's a lot more commonplace in Tier 2 and Tier 3 matches, but uh, overall, it's it's a fun little tank. It's just something to go screw around in, um, and if you don't believe me, there there's the stats. It's got 40 millimeters of armor everywhere, hence the name of the Micro Mouse, but yeah, it's, it's a fun little tank. Don't be expecting to get much out of it, but it's just a fun little thing to go derp around in a Tier 2 match. Anyway, folks, that about wraps it up for this video. I'll catch you next time. Thanks for watching.